Well, we've got a stuck hood that won't open, and we actually had a cable that pulled undone. Ryan's Mobile One. The best way to get these undone, I get a dental tape like this, and then come in from behind, you pry this back, and then push in the tab. You'll see that there's a little tab here and here. There should be another one in these various locations, but they're all busted off. This only had to, I promise I didn't break any on this. This is a 2001 with 150,000 miles on it. Once you get that out, um, then you've got this little grill piece that's just kind of floating back in there. So uh, this far corner, the one that's at the bottom by the headlight, just rotate that down. Just kind of wiggle it as you go. So this is what the cable looks like. The cable actually popped off the end of it. Now what you may find happens with this, and this is the one with the, the little rod that comes down. This isn't the one with the arrow, plunger, round circle thing. Uh, but what can happen is this will come off like that, and your spring will still be in there, and it'll be pushing it in the closed position, the return position. And you'll just have your cable hanging out. That's what we had here. So there's this fin that blocks access to everything. So you take a pry bar and just pry it up like that. So we've already got that done. So this was a flathead screwdriver. I sharpened it to a point and then I bent it to give it you know, 25 millimeters of length after the 90. But you just take this, you come up around the top of it, and then there's uh, a little ball. We'll show more detail later. Uh, but basically you just come up over the corner like this and then hook it down. I think this one might already be pulled. Yep, we're pulled. So the reason this broke is because it's really gritty. It needs some lubrication down each side of this. When you trigger this to be closed, if you look down through here until you can see the ball, you see the ball right there. So you reach in and you pull that ball back. Once you pull the ball back, you've got to lift up on the hood or the latch, either one, and it'll pop up. And like I say, this one's really stuck, so you gotta pull on it like you mean it. That's how you get them open. So you'll be working through the hole here over the top of the air shroud. But you basically stick your 90 degree pick in there, and then just shepherd's crook uh, the thing back, and then while it's pulled back, lift up on the hood. It's not gonna wanna come easy if it's, I say it's not gonna wanna come easy, but it will come up. The three bolts that hold this in, there's one here, one here, and one here. You can see I bent this up uh, just to get into it a little bit for pulling it out. This one's worn out. It should pop up without assistance, but I'm going to pull on it. Go ahead and pull it. So it just works like that. Pull it again. So there you go. One more time. And uh, this is sealed up like a box. You can't get to any of the guts of it, just the lever. If you have a problem, it's going to be because the cable broke or something of that nature. Cable slips in on this underside. So if you pull this thing out, it's going to be so much easier to put the cable back on. Keep it lubricated and then you won't have to mess with it. Which begs the question, how do you lubricate it? I just send the uh, cleaner solvent lubricant into there, just some combo thing. So the only other thing to do is to put that back down. So you just put that bend it back with your pliers you can look at the other side see what it looks like and then just keep on trucking until you've got a match on both sides just like that looks good no harm no foul this needs to come down just a hair and we're done so if you like this video you want to see more videos i've got a bunch of bmw videos uh, they're all in a playlist and uh, you can just click on this right here or if you want to see my latest video you can click on this one right here Thanks for watching. Cheers. Thanks for watching. Be sure to click like and subscribe.